oftentimes movie trailers are actually more interesting than the actual movie. And uh, here I have an example of one of those. Uh, I'll show you here. I've got uh, about 11 minutes of content uh, of a trip that we did to Vancouver Island some time ago. And uh, um, cutting this together to something interesting is actually fairly challenging because the shots, as you can see here, are really bad. So movie trailers in iMovie is what I use here to make a fairly short clip, but it actually looks very professional. So here, let me show it to you. So as you can see here, even though the shots are very normal, there's not much to it, uh, in many cases are actually fairly lame, the movie trailer actually makes it feel more interesting. And um, the reason for that is because the movie trailer here controls not only the texts and the titles, but the timing of the videos, and it actually suggests what kind of content you should be presenting for each one of those clips. And, uh, and that's the beauty of these movie trailers in iMovie, is that they guide you through what you need to literally just click to select, and, uh, and the movie trailer will be put together fairly quickly. Now, before we get into creating a movie trailer, let's explain roughly what uh, the different elements in the interface are, and then we'll start getting into uh, what you're going to need to do before you create a movie trailer, and then the actual process of creating one. The first thing that you see here on the left-hand side in the project window is the storyboard. And uh, it's not the first thing that you see, though. It's the first thing that you're seeing right now. Typically, when you start a movie trailer, you start in outline view. And in the outline view, you enter the generics of your project. And all of this that you enter is actually in text. So the name of the movie, when it's supposed to be uh, released, uh, information about the cast, and uh, if I go down to the bottom, we get to see information about the studio, which is supposed to be sort of a fictitious company that puts together the video or the movie. And at the very bottom, the credits. Uh, one of the things that you're maybe noticing, though, is as I roll over the different sections on the window here on the right-hand side, we actually get to see uh, a visual representation of that particular section. So if I go to the top, and roll over the cast, you get to see the way they are going to appear on the actual project. Some general information about the window here is depending on the kind of template that you choose for the trailer, some would have more or less uh, space for cast members. This particular one so far has three cast members, but we can add the last cast member or add more cast members as required. And the other thing that I wanted to mention about the credits is that iMovie by default fills it up with the name of the account that is logged in right now using iMovie. In this particular case, as you can see here, the name of this account is called Mac Pro Video. If you have your own name in your account, this information will be filled up with your own name. The storyboard shows you a graphical representation of the different shots that you need to grab and that you need to select depending on the cast members that you enter in the outline view and, uh, and other kinds of shots, for example, if it's an action shot or a medium shot uh, and it's not related to any particular cast member. We'll get to this uh, in more depth once we get to edit our own movie trailer. And the shot list on the very far right, it's just a different way of seeing the clips that you organize in the storyboard, but in this case, they are arranged by topic, for example, by cast members. 
So you can see two for each one of the cast members, two clips for each one of the cast members, uh, five clips for action scenes, five clips for group scenes, uh, and so forth. So the beauty about movie trailers is that you don't have to worry about the difficult things about editing, which is timing and music for that matter. Those are the foundations of iMovies movie trailers. <laughs>